Now, when we say business card, we tend to think of a three and a half by two inch rectangle, but it needn't necessarily be that way. Your business card doesn't even need to be a card at all. Maybe it's going to be a clothes peg or a playing card or a car that someone constructs or a glider. Or maybe it's going to come as a blister pill pack or a, a pop up thing or be printed on metal or rubber or have some wool attached to it or a business card that tears in two. These are all brilliant, brilliant ideas. But we're not going to do this. We're going to go for a standard three and a half inch by two inch business card or reverse those dimensions if you want it to be vertical. But these are all things worth considering. So we're going to play it safe. We're just going to have a purely functional business card. Now, I said a three and a half by two inch rectangle, but there are variations. Business card sizes vary around the world. And this diagram has the common business card sizes. In continental Europe, it may be a credit card size or an A8 size rectangle. But I'm going to be working with the standard US size three and a half by two inches. So now that we've determined our size, the next thing we want to think about is the orientation of the business card. 